Hello, my name is Victoria Yampolsky. I'm the president and founder of the Startup Station, and this is our weekly strategic finance tips. I wanted to do a series of videos on the break-even analysis because I think it's uh, critically important in helping uh, you analyze your business model and finding out if uh, this model is feasible and really gets you to the goals that you want. This video is about the number of subscriptions. So this is the scenario that we have. It's a SaaS model. What we want to do is determine how many paying subscriptions we need to, power, to cover our costs. Let's say that their uh, costs are 10 million. Uh, what we need to know here is we need to know the breakdown between the 12 month and one month subscriptions. We're going to assume that we have two types of subscriptions here, as well as we need to know their pricing. We will assume just one variable cost for this example, which is AWS, and we will specify it per month per subscription. Okay, so let's do the actual analysis for the number of subscriptions. So what we see here is the fixed cost of 10 million. We're assuming that the monthly AWS cost per subscription is uh, 10 cents. Now, these numbers are all examples. Please don't use these numbers for your own calculations. Uh, we're going to assume that the one month subscription price is $30 and we're going to um, give subscribers 20% discount for 12 months. So we're calculating it as $30 times 12 times 80%. And then we're going to assume that the percentage of one month subscriptions is 75%. Now, this is all we need in order to perform this analysis. Of course, if you need to do it over five years, you just figure out what these values are over five years. Okay, so what we're trying to determine is our break even number of subscriptions. This will be the input to the model and we're going to link everything either to our assumptions or to this input. And what we're trying to do is to make this row 26, zero or as close to zero um, as possible. Okay, so let's build the logic. So we know the break-even number of subscriptions. So the first thing we need to do is to calculate how many one-month subscriptions we have. So we're going to take a ceiling function because you make less money for one-month subscriptions than you do from 12 months. So we're going to take the break-even number of subscriptions times the percentage of one-month subscriptions and round it, right? Um, now, the next thing we're going to do is to calculate number of 12 month subscriptions, which will be the total number of subscriptions minus the one month number of subscriptions. Uh, let's put some number here so that we don't get uh, zeros. This will be our input. So I'm going to make it in blue, right? And we're going to change this number to get to the desired cost. We know that our fixed cost is 10 million, so we can immediately link that. Okay, so now we can calculate the one month subscription revenue. This will be the number of one month subscriptions times the price. Similarly, we can calculate the number of 12 month subscriptions, which will be uh, the revenue from 12 month subscriptions, which will be the number of 12 month subscriptions times the price. Our total revenue will be the sum of the two. Okay, now we have to calculate the AWS cost. We're taking the uh, monthly subscriptions and we are uh, multiplying by uh, a monthly AWS cost. And we're taking the number of 12 month subscriptions multiplying by 12 and multiplying by AWS cost. So we're summing those costs up to get our variable costs. And the gross profit will be total revenues minus total variable costs. Okay, now we're going to subtract um, fixed costs from the gross profit. Of course, we see a really big number here, which means that we have to significantly raise the break-even number of subscriptions to get to zero. Let's see what this can be. Um, let's try 150,000. This is too much. We can also use a gold seek function. Uh, so let's see, let's try 90,000. Okay, let's try 100,000. Okay, 110,000. Okay, this is too much. 105,000. Okay, 106. 
Okay, so we're very close. So we can either stop here because it's immaterial or we can get a little bit closer to zero. Uh, so the only restriction is the number of subscriptions, of course, has to be whole. So you may not be able to get to zero here. Okay, so I think this is good. Three. Okay, so you can get straight to zero, but you can get to $200. So the break even number of subscriptions in this case is 105,864. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share with your friends and colleagues. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more very useful videos every Tuesday and follow us on social media. If you want to learn how to build credible financials, please um, sign up to our free masterclass at Build Credible Financials for Your Venture. The link is in the description. Thank you again and see you next week.